According to the recommendations released by International Society, screening for liver disease should be carried out with ultrasound every six months, targeting patients with chronic liver disease of any etiology with a special reference to those with advanced liver disease, one above all patients with cirrhosis, possibly patients with compensate cirrhosis. Of course, uh, this strategy is uh, mainly based upon uh, activity at the hospital side, which requires commuting of the patient from the community to the uh, point of care. And this is uh, felt to be not really a cost-effective strategy. Everybody wishes that uh, a tool will become soon available, possibly a serum marker, to uh, bring uh, uh, screening for liver cancer from the hospital side to the community but we are still far from this end point. More recently, in Taiwan and other Far East countries, mass screening with ultrasound of the general population has been attempted, removing the paradigm of first identify patient with cirrhosis because it might, it might be costly, cumbersome, and very selective, and applying uh, a kind of a basket uh, of uh, parameters to select uh, uh, target population, which include uh, sex, age, uh, uh, transaminases levels, uh, and the history, family history of liver cancer. And by using this very simple criterion in applying mass screening with ultrasound, it was uh, found that 95% of all patients with the liver cancer could be easily detected with a significant spare in terms of cost, money, and also access to the hospital facilities.